Hello everybody, it's Michelle and I've got some new toys from Arteza that I've been playing with and I can't wait to show you guys. I've had so much fun with this. First of all, I've got the large 18 by 24 inch chalkboard and that comes with a set of markers here. You've got a set of eight of the bright colors in the chalk markers along with an eraser and then you've got the hardware so you can hang your chalkboard on the wall if you want to do that. So that all comes with the chalkboard, but there are some other things I've got that you can buy separately, and I want to show you guys those as well. So I've got the cleaner set here, and I think with the chalk markers, this is going to be very important. You've got your chalkboard cleaner here, and that's in a nice spray bottle. It came packaged with just a regular lid, and the sprayer was separate in there, and you just take the seal off the inside of that and put your sprayer in and then you get another eraser here and a microfiber cloth and i've got so many colors in the chalk markers to show you guys i just love these i've got the brights but like i said you do get the set of eight brights along with the big chalkboard here but i've got a set of 16 brights here with lots more color options in there and then I've got a set of 16 Earth Tones, which both include the white. And the white is also included in the eight-piece set that comes along with the board. And you know the white is very important for chalkboard art. And then I've got a set of eight metallic colors, and I can't wait to show you guys these. They are so pretty, and I just love these markers. So when you first use your markers, you're going to need to prime those, which I've already done most of these. But you just have to shake that up. And you pump that tip just like you do a paint pan or something like that. And you get that flowing down into that. Can't see that very well on the white. Let me get another one and see if I can show you guys maybe one that I haven't done yet. So we'll get our earth tones here. And I love these earth tone colors. I think they are so pretty. I'll try this purple one here. So see, you just got that yellow tip with nothing flowing into it yet. You just want to give that a shake and then press down on that tip and pump it a couple of times. They do take quite a while to get started. That's why I kind of went ahead and pre-primed a lot of these to save some time in the video today. And there you go. That just gets it flowing for you. So I'm just going to draw a few little things on here to show you guys a little bit about these markers so you can see how opaque and vibrant they are. I just love them. Okay, here we go. I'm going to make a flower for the O in home. That way you can see some of these other brighter colors and see what we've got going on here. I'm going to use the yellow from my Earth Tone set for the center of my flower. So here's a pink one from my Earth Tone set as well. If you guys can see how opaque that is. I think that's so pretty. It's not showing up on camera quite as bright as it is in real life. I'll get you guys a better picture at the end. I'm going to get some of my white back in there to tie it in with the rest of the word. I really want to 
show you guys some of these metallics. I hope they show up on screen. So I don't know if you guys can see that metallic quality going on there, but I just love it. I put a few little places that I can add some flowers here. And let's use some metallic colors for flowers as well. See, after you allow it to dry, you could just go right over those other colors with another color. I wish I didn't have that glare. There you go. That looks a little better. forgot to mention you guys that with these sets of markers they all come with some labels I'll open that and show you guys what's in there they also have a set of tweezers and they've got little teeth on them they're grippy tweezers to help you change the tips they come with tips that you can trade out if you guys noticed they come already with the rounded tip in those, but in every set you get new tips that are a chisel on one end or a fine point on the other. And you've got enough in there to change all the markers in your set if you want to do that. So I meant to point that out to you guys. I'm sorry about that. And I'll show you guys some of the labels too. They've got them in different sizes and shapes. Here are some smaller ones. And these would be really great I think if you wanted to make some homemade treats or gift in the jars, you guys know that I love to do the gift in the jar for gift giving, especially around the holidays and stuff. And you could take your chalk markers and write the name of whatever's inside. You could use them to label your canisters, just things at home, whatever you decide to do. And here... We've got some stencils also. You've got your numbers 0 through 9. And then you've got some little icons. And that's more labels there. So I think you guys are really going to like these sets. There's, that wasn't torn out of the stencil. So you can see that number 2 properly. So there you go, guys. That's my quarantine artwork, I guess, for the day. I hope everyone is staying home and staying safe. I've been staying home all that I can. 
but I've been passing my time with some crafting and some artwork and I hope you guys can do the same. If you guys want some of these Arteza products, I will put some links in the description to the ones that I have here as well as some more options. They've got so many options for different sizes of chalkboards and different color sets of the markers, but don't forget the cleaning set. I think that's very important. I think you guys are going to love them. I've decided that I want to get one of the smaller ones and maybe see if I can get some magnets on the back of it to put it on my refrigerator and use it for my new Bible scripture board. So check out all the options in the description below and be sure to order you guys some. I'll also put my coupon code in the description below as well and you guys can use that for 10% off of your purchase. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, give me a like over on my Facebook page, and be sure to join our Facebook group, Crafty Minds. Also, follow me on Pinterest and Instagram, and don't forget to visit my blog. I'll have the links to everything in the description, along with those product links and coupon code, so be sure and check those out. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.